There is nothing better than a bowl of soup on a chilly fall day. And here to show us a recipe with seasonal ingredients is Chef David Sims from Eatable Delights in Philadelphia. Eatable Delights, not Edible Delights. That's yes, right. And uh, you, you're going to make a soup that it's my one of my all-time favorites for fall. Anything with pumpkin is good. Pumpkin soup is amazing. It's a really great recipe. Mm -hmm. It's really simple. Anyone can do it at home. It's caramelized pumpkin. You just put the pumpkin in the uh, oven and then what you do is you put all the ingredients on the stove. Okay. You want to cook all of your dairy products first, your half and half, your heavy cream, your butter, and then you want to add in all of those seasonings that's just going to bring everything together. Sounds good. There's cinnamon, there's nutmeg, there's brown sugar, right. and we're going to actually have you demonstrate the recipe today. Alright, let's so do this. Don't be scared, people. Alright, really <laughs> good. There's the diced up pumpkin okay, already. Okay, so I just pour that in? You just pour that right on in. Okay, and I told you that I bought butternut squash the other day and I didn't know what to do with this. It's with it and similar with pumpkin it sort of scares me so sure. just buy it ready made this is actually the last part of the recipe because what you're going to actually do is cook all the ingredients first and it's actually going to be put into the blender okay so it's a really great recipe okay heavy cream heavy cream mm -hmm. what do we got next half and half right there a little bit of butter Oh, just a little bit. Just a, just little, a bit. little bit yeah. of butter. Butter makes the recipe really good, and here's a spoon. <laughs> I was going to say, we're having problems. All right, some butter. Yes. This almost sort of reminds me of like a dessert in a way, you know? We're the just going to blend this up really quickly. All right. Looks good, and then. And now you're going to add in your seasons. That's actually salt to taste, so, so that's okay, actually Okay, that's just the taste. What do we have here? Correct. We have cinnamon. Cinnamon. Nutmeg. Nutmeg. And then we've got some brown sugar. Really? Brown sugar brown is the sugar. essence. It's so good. It makes the recipe wonderful. Okay. I'm going to blend that up again. See, that again sort of reminds me of something that is almost a little dessert-like, but it's not going to come out too sweet. So we blend it all up. We blend it all up. And this is your finished product. And this product. is what it looks like. It looks amazing and creamy. Oh, mm. it's so good. And we've actually tossed it with some cranberry orange. Uh, raisins on right. top. So good. It can be served in a bowl or it can actually be served in one of these little mini pumpkins. So, oh, that's very cute. Yes, no, you yes, see, sir. you can serve it in a pumpkin. I will probably just sort of take it right out of the uh, pot. Absolutely. It's <laughs> so good. It's so good. Any fall day, it just will be wonderful. So, once again, this, this stuff is first put in the oven. Correct. Right? Okay. Do I have a spoon? Can I try? Yes, What's you going do. on here? Here we are. <laughs> and I'm sure you're just going to love it. And I'm sure I'm not going to share any of it. Yeah. Mm, oh my gosh, it is sort of like... Inspired by Eatable Delights. Mm -hmm. and this is the best way to eat your vegetables, right. I think. This is fantastic. Thank you very much. And of course, uh, You can go Eatable to our Delights? website, okay. www.eatable, E-A-T-I-B-L-E, Delights, okay. D-E-L-I-G-H-T-S.com. Great. Thank you very much. I'm going to send it back to you. I'm not going to share.